What's up Goonies? Welcome to my very first Metro Royale video in Season 2. Now I've covered some, uh, you know, the Runic event, the Runic Power event, whatever you want to call it. I've covered that the first week or so, and now I've switched gears and I'm covering Metro Royale once again. Now, one of the changes that I noticed right away in Metro Royale uh, was what we're going to talk about in today's video. What is that, Goonies? What is it? I know you're just chomping at the bit. Well, as you guys know, in Season 1, dog tags were worth 10k. Now, you know, that's, that's a pretty good take for a dog tag, and therefore it would make you, you know, definitely want to get, you know, retrieve the dog tag because it's 10k. But this season, they're 25k. Now that my friends is a huge difference um, what does that mean I think that that is PUBG Mobile's way of encouraging uh, encounters or combat with other teams and it is a welcome uh, welcome addition to uh, season 2 in Metro Royale because hey 25k for a dog tag bros I was searching and destroying let me tell you uh, they have definitely made it super important to seek out these other teams yes you can loot and stuff but seek them out try to get as many dog tags as you can uh, each game because hey it's a big payday in the end so with that being said I'm gonna show you some game highlights and I'll break in every now and then to talk about it so let's just get started Most of these engagements take place in map number one and specifically in battle line battle line is one of the greatest places in map number one to loot in my opinion uh, it has a lot of concentrated loot in a small area it is also a great place to seek out engagements because all teams typically gravitate to battle line so if you're wanting to collect extra dog tags head to battle line in map one uh, and as you see here my gear I've got a level six vest no plates i got a level four helmet hey guys i just started my season i literally have been been off this game for the first week so i'm a little behind right here i see this guy level six gear i got explosive ammo and i don't get the knock now important note here i'm stopping this and i'm pausing it because as you see here my teammate zach is knocked now he has not told me he's knocked he told me he is getting pushed um, <clears throat> I finally realized that after a second, but I'm not focused on that cross up there, nor am I focused on that little thing in the very top left of the screen. I am focused on listening and hearing my enemy, and believe me, when you're in this situation, the more communication, the better. So let's get started and go back in. There's the guy. I see him, but I also got a guy that I shot, and I'm like, oh, oh, you're dead. Oh, you're dead. Well, he's going to be. So right here, I'm trying to move in. Zach has been thirsted. And we go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Now, I'm pretty pissed right now, so I'm trying to finish him. But we've got another guy coming up here, and we're going to meet him right here. Now, pay close attention to where my shots are concentrated. Uh, most of them with these last two guys are, in fact, headshots. And that's where you need to be aiming. Look at my health right now. I've just taken down three guys... Um, and the majority of it, the first guy was a battle. I, I shot him all over the place. But the second two guys, I went for the head. And that's why I got the takedowns. Now, unfortunately in this match, and I'm laughing because they're dead. Um, I don't get all the dog tags, which I'm preaching to you guys. Because I'll end up with eight kills at the end of this match. And I don't have eight dog tags. So I dropped the ball on that. Or either my teammate maybe have got a thirst. I don't know. He didn't because he was down. So that's not the case. I just dropped the ball. I had so much loot. Look at all this loot. Now some of that is my teammates. I think the 762 rounds are his. And I saved them for him. Uh, but then I picked up anything that was purple. I picked it up. So I got two dog tags right there. But I should have had three. Now right here I hear shots. And I'm going to push towards these shots. I said I'm going to take a look. But I won't engage unless I feel like I can win the fight. And that's what I just said. And I'm talking over myself. But hey, there you go. Now 
Now I hear shots right there. That's an MK, which is dangerous. Always remember, when you hear an MK, that is the most dangerous weapon in this game. Now, people will argue that point, but I'm telling you right now, an MK is deadly. Let's get back into it. So, so right there, that's two MKs. Two MKs, and they're on different sides of me, and I hear people in the house to my left. Then I go back, because I want to take out the guy below me first, um, but I don't know where he's at. And I'm trying to ease into this. And to be honest with you guys, I should have just backed out of this fight. But dog tags are worth 25k. I'm greedy. I need that Metro cash. Right here, I see him. So right here, and this is explosive ammo right here. Note that. And I finally get this guy. Uh, reload. He's down. And there's his teammate. I'm going to back down right here and heal. But notice now I'm on green ammo. That guy's level six. I'm on green ammo. I got a met up. He could have killed me easily here. But me backing away, that guy went straight to revive. And I was able to met up. And let's see if I can beat this guy. There we go. It's a wrap. It's a wrap, guys. Now I'm going to get a few more dog tags here, but my bag was full. So I ended up not collecting. I think that's where I left some of my dog tags. I end up with only five, I think, dog tags at the end of this game. And I run into two more guys right here because I know you're doing the math. You're going, Goon, that's not eight. That's not eight. You are correct. You are indeed. One bot. That's a fact at the very beginning. You guys remember that too. There you go. Uh, stay up to date on Instagram. Hey guys, these little, uh, look at this, look. Whoa, two guys right here. I got corroded ammo. Take note, corroded ammo. Wow. Mm. And I'm gonna take these guys down. I'm gonna try to get their tags. One thing I want you to remember too, um, you know, this, you know, you need you need to, you need to really try for headshots as much as possible when you can, with with lower level ammunition such as corroded or such as uh, green um, or blue for that matter. Uh, these do not have that extra punch you need to finish them off, and so you need to hit them in vital places. And I was able to get it done so let's look at the totals let's look at my kills and I'm laughing I'm having a good time it's all good ah oh, I can't see them because of my bad editing I'll have to fix that in the edit but as you guys see here I had eight eight real players defeated um, and so I'm going to tell you guys, uh, this first night of playing Metro was an absolute pleasure, and I played it like a man on a mission. And right here, look at this poor guy. He started shooting, and uh, he, uh, he let us know where he was, and I got a knock, and that's the end of him. There he is. I was going to talk to him a little bit, but he tried to squirm away. You know. By the way, I still haven't bought a level six helmet yet. Um, I made my first million, uh, I think, last night, was it? So I've been kind of cheesy right now or cheap. But right here, we're back into Battle Line. As I said, Battle Line is the key. Uh, if you want these engagements, if you want to get these 25k dog tags, right here I start tagging this guy. And honestly, I, I just potatoed. I potatoed. I wasn't happy about it. Two more guys here. So this guy's standing still for me. So I'm going to... Oh, I, I trade off. I get the knock on the other guy, but this other guy is laying down. Oh, oh, I didn't get the knock. Oh, I got both of them. Okay, cool. So... They tried to play it slick. Uh, they almost had me. But explosive ammo in a improved M4 works miracles. Now my teammates got a knock over there. 
I've got two kills here. I'm going to push up. Now, right here, this guy comes out on me, and I got a second guy, so I got to run to reload. Now, he doesn't know where I'm at, but guess what? All I did was uh, looped around and took him out. It was just like taking candy from a baby, as they always say. It's a terrible thing, but hey, you know, if, you, uh, if you're if you not experienced with the loop-de-loop -loop or the huckle-buck, that's what's going to happen to you. Right here, I got a low-armored guy in the tower. My teammate did not see him, but I seen him. And he is not. He is not. We're kind of discussing it right now. By the way, guys, um, these calls to action you see uh, on, on down below there, uh, feel free to, to uh, check the description out. Check out my socials. If you're on Twitter, if you're on Instagram, if you are on Discord, please feel free to join those and get involved with my community. But that's pretty much a wrap, and that's what I wanted to show you guys. I wanted you guys to realize just how important each engagement is and for you guys to get that loot it's went from 10k to 25k goonies and that in and of itself promotes fighting in this game they have now put emphasis on taking out other teams before it didn't really matter so with that being said leave a like if you enjoyed the video uh tune in you know subscribe to the channel and tune in for the next of course metro royale content i'll you know i'll mix in an occasional classic here or there but hey uh, if you guys enjoy, definitely, definitely smash like. Get in those comments and let me hear from you. And with that being said, thank you so much, Goonies, for watching. And I am out of here.